Well, I would like to uh, brief you something about a very helpful uh, way of finding uh, scales. You know, you don't need to mug up all these scales. If you are playing one uh, second position of any scale, and uh, let's say if you want to play uh, two octaves, so all you need to do is like, you need to remember two positions, two position in terms of your fingers. And uh, those are two basic structures. Now, if you know these two positions, you'll get you'll get all the scales. All you need to do is like you need to know the fret name, like all the different frets has the individual name. So if you know that which note is this, which note is this, and uh, if you start playing scales from that note, You'll, you'll get all the scales uh, starting with G. So I'll play uh, first octave for you. So this is the first position. Right? Uh, as I've already shown you this <coughs> position in a G major scale, uh, once again, I'll show it for you. The same structure if you follow from this note it will become G sharp scale so as you can see my fingers they are the same from here uh, when I play it became uh, G sharp scale now the same thing if I'll play play from here it will become a scale from here it will become a sharp scale from here it will become B, C, C sharp, D, right. So this position if you know you can play all the scales starting from last string now similar kind of thing uh, is there when you start playing scales from your fifth string for an example c i'll start with c so this is c scale now from here it will become c sharp scale from here it will become d scale D sharp scale, E, F scale, F sharp scale. So you see first octave uh, fingers and the position, the structure, it remains the same whether you are playing on last string or you are playing on the fifth string. I'll once again show uh, one scale each from fifth string and from sixth string uh, but to start uh, i'll start with uh, string number sixth this was a scale now d scale so you must have observed my finger the distance from each fret remains the same it's just that i'm i'm going one string down from sixth to uh, fifth and this is a technique to remember your scales i hope you are clear with this topic thank you